Hi there, I'm absolutely unqualified in everything except my truth. And I'm gonna try, and that's all I'm gonna talk about. I'm gonna try to keep it light right now, but let's be real, my truth is, personal truth is seldom that. Um, today's topic is snorkeling. Yesterday I took my niece um, to the beach and she wanted a snorkel. So I got her, you know, the, the goggles and the snorkel thing and she tried her best to use it. And it just made me think about just snorkeling in my life and it was so cute the first time I ever snorkeled independently was in um this little local beach called Lambanog in or not Lambanog Lambog in Cebu and it was so fun being in the ocean and looking down at like this little fish society that everything seemed harmonious and beautiful made me want to live there and be a fish <laughs> um and uh, I loved it so much and I love the Philippines and I love that I'm able to do that when I'm over there um and it just made me like I've wanted to not live in human world for so long and it made me long that so hard it was something I bonded with my brother over um and my amazing sister <laughs> booked this place like without even consulting us but it was the best time ever um, I also one time went on a date, a first date with this wonderful person who I fell in love with immediately because our first date was so fun. We went snorkeling in Laguna Beach and he taught me how to dive down and all this great stuff and I fell in love and <laughs> he ended up being a person who struggles with addiction and I had never experienced a relationship with somebody like that. Um, and he and you know i thought that a dui would like you know make it so that somebody stopped being addicted but i didn't understand the weight of that struggle uh in a very similar way that people don't understand the weight of my struggle and i feel really guilty about that i take full responsibility for how that must have been for them to have a lover who just didn't get it and that's okay. Um, I was learning. I'm still learning. I'm going to be learning forever. Um, and you know what? Like, that's my truth. And I'm, people be struggling. And if you don't talk about it, then people don't know what they're dealing with unless they independently research it, which I just have never done. And maybe I should. Um, but I you know i'm happy i got a snorkel again and my partner and i snorkeled in san diego and we had a really fun time even though we didn't spend a lot of time with our faces in the water it was just nice to have the gear in case we decided to it was an accidental three hour ocean excursion and it, snorkeling really reminds me of really light good fun times and really dark ones which i think is beautiful and i love the activity um my inspirations for today are finding nemo which is a beautiful art piece that really depicts um parents and children's endless hell-bent journey to misunderstand each other until you reach a point of desperation um, which I'm guilty of and I feel bad about, but it's giving me hope in my area of despair right now. Um, and um, my other inspiration is my sister, Naughty Kids, H Hannah Lamas, this gorgeous woman who has always lived her life unapologetically. She's wild and she takes full ownership of it and is uh forever inspiration of me and um an artist uh who does pop or like animation styles in filipino cultural apparel i will i don't know the name but i'll tag them below their wow their art really takes me to all my times in the philippines and makes me really happy um but that's it it's short but my that's my truth today um thank you for listening let me know if you have anything you want to say in the comments below i am biting off a lot that i really can't chew and i'm building mindfulness around that and trying to 
fix it for myself. So thank you and tune in tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.